Russia waging new hybrid war against Georgia. President Zurabishvili, despite failure or because of it, Russia has launched a new hybrid war against Georgia using all forms of weapons, stated the president of Georgia, Salome Zurabishvili. According to her, Russia continues to wage a hybrid war against Georgia using all its tools. Speaking about the challenges facing Georgia in 2023, the president of Georgia recalled the war in Ukraine. Russia could not break Ukraine. Indeed, it failed to undermine the unity and solidarity of Europe and even strengthened it. Despite failure or because of it, Russia has started a new hybrid war against Georgia for which it uses all forms of weapons. Zora Bishvili said, she also emphasized that Russia's plan to turn the Ochamchira port into a military base aims to shift the confrontation to the Black Sea into their territorial waters, thereby creating a threat to the strategic perspective of the Black Sea. Zorabishvili spoke about the declaration of mobilization in the occupied territories as well as the steps taken toward annexation, mentioning the capture of the Ochamchira port, the state residence in Bitsivinti, and the Babushera airport in Sukumi. According to her, constant intimidation, persecution, kidnapping, and killing of residents continue along the occupation line. The official authorities of Georgia consider Abkhazia and South Ossetia as territories occupied by Russia. Earlier, the head of the occupation administration of Abkhazia, Aslan Bzania, claimed to have reached an agreement with Russia to establish a base on the region's territory where the Black Sea Fleet will be stationed. However, the Parliament of Georgia decided not to consider a resolution condemning the plans of the Russians to build a base for the Black Sea Fleet in occupied Abkhazia.